freshly sealed asphalt driveway or parking lot provides a deep black appearance that looks attractive to property owners and can help extend the life of the asphalt. These pavement sealers are often made up of a mixture of sand, clay, polymers, water, and either asphalt or coal tar. Pavement sealers that contain coal tar have come under increased scrutiny in recent years due to concerns over the presence of high levels of polycyclic aromatic hydrocarbons, commonly referred to as PAHs. PAHs are found naturally in the environment, but they can also be man-made. They can be created when products like coal, oil, gas, and garbage are burned when the burning process is not complete. When coal tar containing PAHs are used to seal asphalt, it can break off into small particles and dust due to vehicles driving on it and other activities. Not only can these materials then be washed off into the environment and waterways, but they can also be tracked into homes, schools, and other buildings. Some PAHs have been identified as having carcinogenic and mutagenic properties. As of 2013, both Minnesota and Washington have banned pavement sealers that contain coal tar. Other states and municipalities are also reportedly looking into similar bans. Some major retailers have already stopped selling sealants that contain coal tar. According to some studies, health and cancer risks due to exposure to PAHs in coal tar-based sealants may be greatest when children are exposed. This may be due to a number of factors, including children's development and small size as compared to the amount of exposure, hand-to-mouth activities, and the amount of time spent playing on or near locations that have the sealant. Fortunately, pavement sealers that contain emulsified asphalt in place of coal tar are reported to have lower levels of PAHs. These are just a few things to know about asphalt sealants and PAHs. To learn more about this or other environmental, health, and safety issues, please visit the website shown on the screen. IAQ-TV, the place to be.